Hey guys, welcome back to my Let's Play of Jack and Baxter, the Precursor Legacy. Last time we went through Misty Island and got everything. And this time we're gonna explore the rest of... We're gonna explore Rock Village and probably find out what people are up to here. Well, I hope you packed the lunch, because we're just getting started. According to the Blue Satyr's notes, lurkers have infested the swamp across the bay. Apparently, they're planning to use a dirigible to lift an important precursor artifact from the bunk. You're going to have to get over there to dislodge their tethers. Who knows what they might want with the artifacts? But like orange stuff here's breath, it just can't be good. Yeah. Uh that's in uh the the foggy swamp. There's three places we can go here in Rock Village. The Precursor Basin, which might which we might actually actually we are gonna do that. We're gonna go there today. The Boggy Swamp, where that Zeppelin is over there. And there's also the Lost Precursor City. Now, even with power cells, do we have enough power? Uh, we're gonna talk to Kiro one more time. Back again, boys? Boy! Hey, babe, I'm a full grown. Uh, something. something pleasant. Oh, guess what? With permission from our village bird watcher, I've outfitted a baby flutlet with a riding saddle. It appears there's a precursor tank pad in the boggy swamp. If you can find it, I'll send you the flutlet in full riding regalia. Her long jump might come in handy when you're crossing the tar. I think we'll go to the boggy swamp, maybe the next part. But for this part, we're going to just explore pretty much Rock Village. And sorry if there's only one video this week. I don't know. I feel like many things have happened this week. This weekend, that is. I mean, I was at my friend's house. Find out why the blue disappeared. You're going to need to collect 45 power cells to fuel his machine. Go I was pretty much at my friend's house playing video games and stuff. So, yeah. And, you know. Uh, we're gonna talk to this oracle right here. Beware of the dark light, for it has twisted the fate of one of you. Bring me 120 precursor orbs for each power cell I contain. Here is another power cell for your quest. don't have enough for the other power cell because we only have 70. Well, here's Rock. This is part of Rock Village. Okay, right over here is the Precursor Basin. We'll go to the Precursor Basin maybe in a few minutes, but I think we gotta, like, like, ask some of the people, talk to some of the people right here. And now, right over here. Yeah, you have to roll like about three times to get get to here. It's the only way you're going to open this. Now, there's two people I want to talk to, and here, this lady is one of them. You two look like a couple of capable fellows. I've got a research project going, and maybe you could help me out. Hey, we're the ones on a big quest here. We ask you for help. Well, perhaps we can help each other. I've been studying the burrowing habits of lightning bolts in the precursor basin next to our village for years. But now those awful lurkers have scared the moles to the surface. And since they're blind as bats, they can't find their way back underground. If you could herd them back into their burrowing tunnels, you might just save their lives. I've got a power cell that says you can do it. Yeah, lightning moles. We can. Maybe for two power cells. Nice try. But I would be willing to part with another power cell if you two find me 90 precursor orbs for my research equipment. Fair enough? 
Okay. Wait, we've 90 ninety orbs. Ninety three. Oh, you have the orbs. Here's a power cell we agreed upon. That's considered a rock village power cell. The other power cell is from the precursor basin. And right over here, this guy right here in the barrel. Okay, so that's what we have to do. We have to uh, beat the record time at that race over there at the basin. So, we're going to get everything here at the basin. And there is the moles that the lady. Yeah, I did not mean to run into those dark eco boxes. I need to. These were the. These were the moles that uh, the, the lady was talking about. If we heard all four of them into the uh, burrow over there, then we get a power cell. I just have to. As far you ha really have to position it right, and I did not position it right over there. Yeah, it really, yeah, you really have to position it right for, what was it, yeah, yeah, to herd the moles into the burrow over there, or just make them do that, I don't know. It might take a while, actually. Uh, that's two down right there. There's three and four. Okay, I keep running into those moles for some reason. Now we just need him right over there. about that. Apparently, I had to do something... I don't know. I don't even want to talk about it. Meanwhile, it looks like we have our, all the uh, moles inside the holes. I Sorry if I cut that part out. But anyway, I, I, did, put, I did put the fourth mole into the uh, hole. Now let's talk to this lady again, so we can receive our power cell. Those moles, that's awfully good of you. Here's a power cell to help you out. Now I can get back to my research. Alright, back to the basin. Oh, wrong button. We got like pretty much a lot of a lot of orbs to collect. A lot of power cells still needed to be collected. Yeah, we're pretty much gonna spend this entire episode here at the base. Well, almost. Well, yes, yes. Trust me, those dark eco boxes are bad news. They are bad news indeed. Right. Uh, there are four 
of these flying lurkers right up here, uh, here, in, here in the Precursor Basin. If we knock into all four of them, we'll get a power cell. And that's what I'm going to do right now. That's one down. Just three more to go. Damn it. I ran into a dark eco box. I think my mood has just changed within the last minute. I It's just changed. No, I'm better off not talking about it. Because then you wouldn't be so happy about it. You wouldn't be happy about it. So you know what? I'm better off not talking about it. If you want, you can... Uh, Ask me what was wrong in the comments, but you know what? I'm not gonna say it here on video. And I can't seem to get this freaking. I can't seem to get this uh, freaking lurker. Eco boxes. That's three, but I can't even find the fourth one. That's the sad news. There's the dark eco plants that Sam was talked about. I think it was in like part four. If you but I won't get that just yet. Apparently I have to find it. that last lurker, which I can't even find anymore. Oh, there he is. What are two of them even doing over here? Didn't I just kill you? Actually, this is, a, this is the fourth lurker. As long as I get to him. Alright, I got him. Dark eco plants right here. That is obviously a green eco plant. Yeah. Usually you get health, which I actually did uh, when getting the green eco. But only here in the precursor basin can you actually have a power up to like prevent the dark eco plants from actually growing. It only happens here. You can't use the green eco for anything else other than your health. I mean, at uh, the beach, apparently, I walked into a green eco vent and what it gave me was just health. But it doesn't give me the power to get rid of all these dark eco plants like they are here in the Precursor Basin. And dang it, I'm out of green eco again. 
it will take multiple, probably, you're going to have to go to the dark, green eco vent multiple times in order to get rid of all these dark eco plants. Yeah. That's only the third one, really? Okay, the next one we have to go... The next power cell is the, uh... We have to fly through all the purple rings over here. shows up for only 10 seconds, so you have only 10 seconds to get to the next ring every time. The purple rings, no problem. They're pretty easy to get. Wait until you get to the blue rings. Yeah, that's gonna be a little bit more tougher than the uh, purple rings are. Yeah, the blue rings are gonna be like link uh, that distance. And there's the last uh, purple ring. And well, there's the power cell. Did I run into that? There, I got my full, full health this time. There's the blue ring on the left side over there, but before I even get to that... I need to get all these uh, precursor orbs. Well, that scout fly, obviously. Crap. I thought that was all the precursor orbs. I guess I'm missing some. I don't know where they are, but they're in here somewhere. reason I didn't go back for that. Dang it. I need to go... Uh, so for some reason I didn't go back for that power sub. Yeah, the blue rings are a lot tougher than the uh, purple rings are. Here, you have to jump at the same time you're going to launch off that rock.
got that ring just in, well, not just in time, but I just barely got it. Yeah, that may look easy, but of course the first time I played this game, it, it obviously took me more than one attempt. of the precursor orbs here. The question is, how many power cells do we have left? We only have two power cells, okay. I know where one of them is. It's right over there. No! jump just like I did with the blue rings. You know, the, the one that was so high that I had to jump off the rock. And so that leaves just the, uh, the race. You're, you need to beat 45 seconds is the record time. Yeah. Watch out for those, uh, things that will block you. Yeah. Like I... You know that the, uh, blue, blue eco obviously makes you faster. And I got a new record. I don't know what time it was, but when I look into the description, not the description, into the video, when I look into the video, then I'll figure out how much time I had. And now I need to just collect my... Well, power cell from him, and then, yeah, I'll pretty much end this video. Oh, great moves, kid. I knew that tiebreaker would fall. Now, here's your power cell, and I can go collect my big payoff. So, oh, yeah, the power cells. Uh, 90 orbs for a power cell. <laughs> He drove to help me win my way back out of this barrel. Here's the power cell, I promise. Okay. So next time we're gonna we're gonna figure out how to get over there without getting eaten by a precursor a lurker shark. We're gonna have to talk to that guy on the right over there, straight ahead. So yeah, thanks for watching, and it was a short thing. Uh, yeah, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next, or next weekend, for the next part of this Let's Play.